Uh, so my name is Marty Walls. I'm uh, the leader of the Solution Architects in the West. And I look after five or uh, six architects who help the sales organisation communicate our services, products and content and how they can consume that in their world. So I, I think the biggest challenge for, uh, for customers in terms of mastering data is uh, a true corporate belief that um, good data is, produces more profitable solutions. And it does. So good data makes better decisions, enables faster decisions, that then ultimately means you're focused on the right things, enabling the right activities, selling the right products to the right customers. Um, it's easy for that to be said, but then take a large organisation where every part of the organisation is focused on their mission. So um, in many of our engagements, um, we run into one of the more standard questions. I've been running for 15, 20 years, and I'm reasonably profitable. Why should I not do the status quo? And I says, well, one, you've probably been making bad decisions and not making, knowing you've been making bad decisions. The question is, can you make better decisions? Okay, And that translates to, what's the opportunity you've left on the table? If you ask a customer how profitable they are, most have an idea. Do you have ask them how much opportunity you've lost or left? They have no idea. Okay, and so that's the approach that I'd rather take. This is how can you be more profitable, gain bigger, more market share, make better decisions, and put all those three things together. Okay, underpinning every decision is data and process. Okay, they come one and the same. Okay, so how can we help you understand? that opportunity, how can we help you then integrate that into your business and then how can we then optimise it with analytics and focus where you can be pinpoint about where you make your investments in the future. Um, back in when I first started, everything was generally manually done. So I started in the telecommunications business helping a New Zealand telecom design telephone networks. And as part of that, we had to document that, where it was in the ground, how it was connected, the relationships between each asset. Well, that was all done by manual teams, manually drawing. Today, that is all 100% driven by software. Okay, and so that actually represents what's happened in almost every business perspective that I've seen in the last 35 years. Manual processes, manual enabled steps are now software driven. Now the biggest change is that used to happen after interaction with the customer. Well now, the customer's interacting with you real time, in many cases without your knowledge. And then you have to understand how to support that from a software point of view. I've always had the opportunity to interact with customers, okay? and. Um, in my current role, I get to see customers realise benefits from using our services and data. That's what actually excites me. Um, if I was an architect and I just created an architecture and then went to the next one and didn't see it being realised, then I don't know if I'd get the current value. So I've always have gravitated to roles where I get to see customers achieve their, their, their needs using our offerings. And that's what drives me every day.